cheered for the Eclipse Orchestra under the direction of Matt Pye right there on the keyboards. He's not faking it, folks. The sweat is real. Thank you. Okay, let's talk about some more. You know where we're going to be? That's yeah, right here. Pretty much, I hope you're here. Some of you are already going away, so you're going to come back and be here later. Uh, day C, so we'll relax, enjoy your celebrity life activities. Two of the big highlights feature looks behind the scenes. At 10.15, it is uh, something we call Heartbeat of the Operation, a chance for you to meet our food and beverage team as they take you on a tour through the galleys. Incredible operation back there. That's 10.15 in the morning. At 1 o'clock here, we do Behind the Curtains, a technical tour of the Eclipse Theater. So if you'd like to know how the shows work, the sound, the light, and the stage automation, we'll be here to talk to you about that at 1 o'clock in the afternoon. Also, dance classes, bingo, beyond the podiums, hot glass shows, trivia games, and lots more. So, fantastic day planned for you tomorrow night. An absolutely phenomenal entertainer show you do not want to miss. Sam came live with the Eclipse Orchestra, 845 and 1045 tomorrow night. For the rest of this evening, the night is jump, the ship is yours, the casino, the martini bar, the molecular bar. Uh, of course, we've got the quasar with the DJ Tyrone. So, wherever you go and whatever you do, the night is jump, the ship is yours, like you said. So, ladies and gentlemen, now there's just one more thing to do. <laughs> Choke time! <laughs> Thank you. Okay, so this is the guy who decides he wants to, he's not happy with his life, he wants to get a fresh start. So he, he, he moves to a different city, gets himself a new job, rents a nice new apartment, to walking distance of town. He's so excited to begin his new life, puts his best suit on. It's Monday morning, 9 a.m. He's walking to work. Now, he's walking past the different businesses and the shops and everything. They're all opening up for the day. He happens to walk past a pet store. As he does, the owner places a parrot in a cage outside the shop for display. Now, the young man walks past the parrot's cage and he hears, Psst, buddy, come here. He looks over the parrot's talking to him. He says, yeah, what is it? The parrot says, you're ugly. That's not very nice to hear, but anyway, he keeps walking, goes to work. He tries to meet people, learn the job. But the parrot's voice is ringing in his brain all day long. Can't get out of his mind. Walks home, store is closed, parrot's gone. But the next day, Tuesday morning, 9 a.m., there he is walking to work. There's the parrot again. Psst, buddy, come here. Looks over, parrot says, you're ugly. He said it again. Now it's ruining his entire second day. Can't go on like this. Wednesday morning, 9 a.m., walking to work. There's the parrot. Psst, buddy, come here. What? You're ugly. That's it. He said it again. He walks into the store, demands to talk to the owner. The guy behind the counter says, yes sir, this, this is my shop. Is there a problem? You seem upset. Yes, I'm upset, he says. I'll tell you why. It's this darn parrot of yours outside. I'm new in town. I don't know anybody. I'm trying to start a new life, get a new job. I got no friends. First thing I got to hear every morning is I'm ugly. It's unacceptable. You got to do something about this bird or I will. Store owner says, sir, I'm very sorry. I apologize. I'll tell you what, I don't have gotten into him. I'll have a word with him. I promise he will never say that to you again. Okay, thank you, man. says so he leaves. Thursday morning, moment of truth, walking to work, 9 a.m., there's the parrot's cage. Psst, buddy, come here, looks over. Yeah, you know what? Parrot says, you know what. <laughs> Takes a very specific sense of humor to appreciate that joke, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for coming to the show. Let's do it again for Pete Matthews. See you tomorrow night. Good night, everybody.